<sighs> Good morning, everyone. Okay, kind of had a really big breakfast now. Uh, mostly egg, bread, and cheese. A good coffee, and uh, now ready for the day. off the shuttle on our way to the airport and uh, hour and a half flight so not a very long flight really happy about that and uh, the normal pre-race ride and mass watch coming up guys okay, well you see the benefits of traveling with only hand luggage is that you don't have to stand in queues like that that's really quite a big benefit and it saves probably about half an hour Okay, so as I was saying, it's, it's really easy to really arrive one hour before our flight, international flights, because we only have a small hand luggage to fly with. So I'm basically away for uh, the 10th, Milan Turin, Piamonte, the 12th, 13th, off, and the 14th, Lombardia. And yeah, I really only have this and my backpack. So I put my laptop and expensive stuff in there and which I basically just put under my feet in the seat in front of me um, and the small hand luggage. Uh, basically everything really saves a lot of time um, because it means you don't miss your flights because you can really make it even arriving 40 minutes before at the airport you can still make your flight 30 minutes as well sometimes and normally flights are delayed so it's really easy. Uh, to make it traveling like this but when you have a big a big luggage bag to check in uh, you can really be late sometimes in the drift south and eastward the central and eastern parts of kansas will very probably be cloudy in the morning and then western kansas will begin to get increasing cloudiness by tomorrow afternoon today however a very very pleasant reading 73 up in the goodland area 72 at garden city 70 reported by dodge city and liberal 72 two, two over at the hey arrived in italy for the italian race bike here in Italy uh, you'll notice that they passed really close to you on these roads it's just a normal Italian style I guess uh, normal pre-race ride uh, not gonna blap around too much uh, five times two minutes at about 420 watts get the heart rate up a little bit um, I only started at like 330 it was another like that car it was another long travel day uh, and then just gonna go get a nice little massage and rest out before tomorrow's races. I'll probably watch a bit of Netflix, we chill out. Oh yes, and also because I don't know the roads that well, um, I always create a quick Strava route, save it to my Wahoo like now. I save it like that so when I end up in a random city like today in uh, Milan, I can easily find a road to travel on and not get lost if, uh, if you're wondering how we know where to go train. Okay, so this is my turnaround. Wireless earphones have really been working great. I mean, let's check this out. Just my phone. No wire, no concentration that I'm focusing here. Yeah? Um, 
the wireless headphones are really awesome and really a safe feature for your children to buy for the parents out there however they might be more on their phones then <laughs> on the bikes i don't know if it's then good or bad but like really look here here's my phone nothing at all really connects really easy with bluetooth so i'm really happy with it and i guess it's cycling related because it makes cycling easier guys i think uh, i'll just stop the vlog yeah uh, thanks for watching um i'm not gonna elaborate too much further i um, really like to just relax these next couple of days and uh, the next vlog will probably be after Lombardia or maybe on the race day before Lombardia on the 12th um, yeah hope you enjoyed the vlog remember to subscribe comment like all of those little things and uh, once again thanks for the support <laughs> Thank you.